Okay. Okay. I'm so shy. Okay, okay, cute. Hey guys, it's me, Kat, and welcome to my April favorites. April. What? April. April makeup favorites video. Okay, guys, my first time recording, so. 90% chance I might screw this up, but we're just gonna go, just gonna go with it, okay? So we're gonna talk about the products that I've been using a lot in the month of April, and let's just get started. Started, okay? <laughs> let's just get started. Okay, so first um, we're gonna talk about eye products, and then we're gonna jump into the lips, and the bronze and the highlight, but in no particular order because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna mess it up. So okay, for the eyes, um, a few months ago, actually, um, two companies from Instagram sent me some eyelashes and. For the first time, I actually tried eyelashes and I like them. And they're, they're not that hard to use, you know, because I, I never got into eyelashes because I thought that they were really, really hard to use. But actually, not really. They were pretty easy. So I'm just going to show you guys. Um, the first company is the first company is called Eyelash Malaysia on Instagram. All the links will be down below. These are the products. Uh -huh. Okay. So my favorite one from the ones that they sent me is in the code 81. 7-2. Okay, I actually have it on today just so I can show you guys and also since it's my favorite so I've practically been wearing this all the damn time. And then the next one is actually by a company called Silver Swan and this company actually their lashes are handmade so I think that's really pretty damn cool. Um, let me just show you guys how it looks like. And this is my eyelash glue. Okay, thank God I didn't break it because I broke the other one. <laughs> so this is um, this is how it looks like. It's a really pretty. This is wood, and this is like hand cra handcrafted. Um, okay, so I got it in two two um, two coats, like two different types of lashes. One is in the coat two zero six Gara, and the other one is in the coat zero nine zero Zamir. And these lashes lashes are so beautiful, especially for like natural makeup look because they're not super long and super curly they're just they're just like um very subtle you know very subtle so i like to use pop this on when i'm just too lazy to put on mascara and i just want really like just want to volumize my lashes a bit more then these are the way to go guys the next one is this company this eyelash malaysia company okay they sent me uh three types of different lashes and they are so dramatic guys they're like the most lightest to put on but yet the longest and the most voluminizing lashes ever okay i mean not that i've tried a billion because like i say it's actually um, my first time using lashes you know it's so good i just wanted you guys to try it out okay so we're gonna go for my favorite um mascara in the month of april it's actually there are actually two mascaras um, the first one is this Lash Sensational by Maybelline and the other one is just the uh, Magnifying Mascara in Jet Black from Coco. So the Lash Sensational, I really like it and been using it a lot for my lower lash line because it is so um, precise and it, how do I say, it doesn't clump the lower lashes and I don't like that. I feel like it's so nice for the lower lashes and for the Coco one, it is... I don't know how to describe it. It really makes your lash looks like you're wearing eyelashes, falsies, you know? When I don't want to wear falsies, but I want to have that falsie effect, I really like the Kobo one. This is really awkward. Um, now let's go to the favorite eyeshadow of the month. Uh, my favorite eyeshadow color of the month is actually from this palette, the Essence Quattro Eyeshadow Palette. I burped. I burped again. Uh, this one in the color uh, cranberry and this cranberry color I've been using it a lot I have it on today as well and then for eyeliner I actually have one that I really really want to show you guys because I feel like it is not um, talked about anywhere I actually um, found this out from a friend and I decided to actually try it out guys it is the blackest eyeliner you will it is the blackest eyeliner, drugstore eyeliner I have ever tried on, okay? Personal personal opinion. Um, and it's this color combos 
waterproof gel eyeliner in the Coop 01 Black. It is this one. It looks like this. Can you? I don't know if you guys can see that. Yeah, it looks like these. It is only 19 ringgit and 90 cents, and it is so black. Look at it. Okay. Um, and it's also I really like this because um, it's really smooth on the eye. Like you legit don't even have to put pressure on it. Let me just show you guys. Okay. I'm just gonna draw another one here. You don't even have to put like pressure on it, and it just gets so black. So. This one is the way to go, but if you're um, a beginner, I don't really recommend this because it is it is so smooth that you might just if you're uh, explain this um, how do I don't explain this okay if you're putting on like <clears throat> the um, black eyeliner on your eye if you're a beginner um, I suggest you guys to try the more the eyeliner that you have to put more force on to get the product out because I find it more easier. Um, because um, honestly, I'm sort of a beginner too, but when I started getting a hang of eyeliner, I feel like that's when this eyeliner really, really, really comes handy to me compared to the others because it's so fast, you just kind of just that and you know, you're done. <clears throat> so that's for eyeliner and then now let's just get to the lip and then go to the face. So I'm going to show you guys sort of like two lip colors. The first one is a new combination. It is actually the um, combination of this Ilianto, um, Ilianto, my oh, brain fried lip liner. Ilianto lip liner in the shade of the Metal Coral. Um, this is actually the swatch of this color. Let me show you guys. This one, and then um, a new lipstick called Nearly Nude by Silky Girl in the line of Go Matte Lip Color. It is this one. Do you guys see how beautiful that is? This one. This is how it looks like. So that's my favorite. Um, that's my favorite new lipstick of the month of April. And if I'm going out at night for a movie or whatsoever, my go-to lipstick this entire April was um, the <coughs> Kovo Ma Magic lipstick in the shade Deep Rose. I actually have it on right now today. Um, it is this one. So beautiful and it's like matte finish and it's just really affordable and here's a tip about Kovo if you guys are planning to buy things from Kovo look out for the sales like for example year-end sales um, like festival sales oh my god guys this brand have crazy sales like I'm talking about 80% and 90% off okay this is when you just you just buy an entire damn pop-up store okay this is when you buy the entire damn pop-up store because I find it the product is so good and like when it's on sale you pay you pay for like really like you know 15 20 ringgit for a lipstick but you get like 80 ringgit quality so that's just a tip the next one I'm gonna show you guys is my favorite bronze bronze and highlighter it's actually by wet and wild and I recently just um just purchased this one it's called the Mega Glow Illuminating Powder. It is this one. Can you guys see it? It is this one. It is in the shade Starlight Bronze. I think they have it in two shades in Sasa. I got this from Sasa, okay? They have Wet and Well in Sasa. I never knew until like a month ago, two months ago. Let me just show you guys. Inside. Do y'all see that? Okay, so um, let me just explain to you guys. You guys can, um, I use all of it for my bronze. And then for my highlight, I just use the top color. Is it? Okay, yeah. For my highlight, I just use that top color. For and it's not super like in your face highlight, but it's a really nice subtle highlight. So I usually, if I want a super in your face highlight, I kind of just mix it with my other highlighters. But so far, um, I just wanted to share with you guys this one, um, for my April favorites because. Firstly, I've been using it a lot, and secondly, that it's so affordable. It's only twenty seven ringgit and fifty cents for like a highlighter, a highlighter and a bronzer. So look out for this one. And I just want to share you guys another weird thing that I did. So there's this one day, um, I needed a bronzer, but I didn't have one at that moment. So I actually took out my um, this palette from Kobo. It's called a Timeless Palette, Timeless Eyeshadow Palette, and then I sort of, I'm just gonna cover this up, I sort of just mix the orange and the um, 
the like reddish orange and the copper orange together and um, it became bronzer and um, no joke it became bronzer so if you guys don't have bronzer and you guys sort of have like an reddish orange and a coppery orange you guys can just mix it up and make it your bronzer I actually have these on today this one mixed with this one like together I have it on today so yeah that's it and I hope you guys like this video you guys can just um, some of the link to the products like the Instagram source will be down below and you guys can follow me on my Instagram don't forget to like and subscribe this video